the thing for them. Hey, Liberian people, how you guys doing? Let us talk Josh Weir a little bit. <clears throat> Everyone are in their forties and in their fifties right now. Let's talk about George Weir. People that are in their forties upward. Let's talk about George Weir. Liberian people don't know George Weir. They don't know George Weir. I am in my forties. I do know George Weir. That's why. I've been looking at people, I just laugh at them. Because they just follow the glory of George Weir. And they don't know him. I've been watching George Weir since the 80s. Since the 80s. I've been watching George Weir. George Weir is one human being that been opportune since... He was born. Josh Weir never ever look in my eyes, never ever suffer or struggle to any normal Liberian. I'm telling you, people, Josh Weir never ever struggle or suffer than any. No more Liberian since Liberia was founded. Josh we have been opportune to all his life. Liberian people don't know Josh Weir. Josh we have been opportune to all his life. And he's a one ungrateful Liberian that don't love the country. But he pretends because of his own self ambitions. That's all. Josh Weir love Ghana than Liberia. I've been to Ghana. I had Ghanaians living in my house. I used to speak three. I still understand and speak most of them. People don't know Josh Weir. Because of his soccer glory. Because Liberia loves soccer. is our number one thing. His soccer glory. People love him. That's all. Tell me what Josh Weir have done for the country to benefit the majority. Let me know. I wait. I told you Josh Weir is ungrateful. I went to school with Josh Weir, two brothers, Clarence Weir and Moses Weir. Ocean View Christian Academy. I went to school with them. It was our seniors. Because I went to school late. <clears throat> In Fiamma, we used to jump overboard, we go eat Gary Yoko and do other stuff. George Weir was coming out in, in the eighties or the early the early stage of his life. Josh Weir had his parents, he had his people. Nobody was fighting war. All the children that were playing soccer, that's where the term came from. People that play football, they are grown up children. Because there were normal schools, beautiful schools. Everything was normal, cheap, and reasonable. Everybody, parents working, making good money. Joshua parents were working, good, making money and other things. Joshua didn't go to school. He never used to like school. He started playing soccer. He don't want to play, go to school. Joe, we all need to go to school because of soccer. Football. Joe, we all need to go to school because of football. <coughs> Joe, we all never suffer. When Joe, we all say, oh, I go to the play. I grew up in the community. I grew up in the community. Joe, we all, he's just a show off. I, when I tell you I grew up in the community, I grew up in the community because I play soccer. I go places. I sleep places. I play third division all the way to second. 
Excuse me. I play high school football in Liberia. So we travel a lot of places. We sleep a lot of places. So it doesn't mean you grow up there. Josh Weir. Josh Weir is one of the most ungrateful human beings in Liberia. He is the most ungrateful human being. Josh Weir. I'm telling you. When I tell you that Josh Weir is the most ungrateful human being, I'm speaking truth, my people. Let me bear all my heart true up. I'm hurt to see our beautiful country with a lot of resources and less him, less citizen, and people dying every day from. No, not even normal, but oh no, things that don't even make sense. Why are people dying? People losing their lives. Why? And Joe, we are saying love the country. He's not paying attention to justice. He's paying attention to development. Development never ends. Liberia don't need development, my people. Liberia don't need development. No, development never ends. So Liberia don't need development. Liberia need a system and a good governance and jobs. Once the jobs come, we the citizens will develop the country. Who developing Liberia right now? The people that are making money. They don't want developing Liberia. And they are not even majority. That's minority making money. And they are developing Liberia. So what if majority making money? Our country will go forward. Forward. Some of us here will build houses in Liberia. Some people build houses in Liberia. A lot of people here building houses in Liberia because why? Our minds are open to development. And we have a job here. So that's why. Liberia don't need... The president is not the one that's supposed to develop the country. Put the system in place. Let the job come. The citizen will build the country. You sit over there, you're fooling yourself. Young people... Young people, the country is in your hand now. They say you're the native. I think the Congo or whatsoever, they, they did better than you What you doing? Young people, what you doing? You feel your giant? Country giant, this giant, Ottawa, Bakuba, whatsoever. You be calling yourself nonsense then? Any of your powerful equal to Charles Tudor? Any of your monkeys powerful equal to Charles Tudor? And you see Charles Tudor, you can't even hear a word from him. Any of you monkeys, even a Prince Johnson, you think you're powerful equal to Charles Tudor? And Charles Tudor today is mute? My people, you put your senses together. Jawia, Jawia. Everything is in your hand, Jawia. Let me let you know, Jawia. The same people that love you, according to the Bible story, Jesus Christ is living today. Because the same people that say, Hosanna, Hosanna, that the same people say, Crucify him. Jawia, put yourself together. You want to do everything. Jealous human being. You self center. You are. Self-centered human being, Jawia. You won't sing? Why people dying, you won't sing? You won't go for that coronavirus treatment from, 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 from this African country. Then the American people send the other one again, you go for it. The European people send it. Who you want to be? What you want to be? Show your true color. Jawia, people not even paying attention to that. You rather dress like Muslim man. You doing things that Muslim man doing all the things that 
you rather you preach it in church. Who you want to be? Who you fooling? Why are you doing all these things? Why are people dying? In our beautiful country. You think the people just put you there because they had a color? The people love you. They want to put you there. That's all. Because of love. They took love. If, 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 and they put love ahead of their self-interest. That will make you a president today. And you messing up. Shall we are? When I say you are the most ungrateful man, these are some of the things. These are facts and truth. I watch you. Charles, I had to call it. Samuel Kanye don't talk care of you. I watch you. I watch you on black and white TV, jo uh, Joia. With your afro. Who are you wearing short pants, short pants, skinny, skinny legs? Joia, I watch you with your afro. On black and white TV, I was baby. I used to watch you. Every time you were around the president, every time you were around the president, taking good care of you. I told you that Joey had never suffered, right? These are some of the things. The president took good care of you. Your, even your father, you never spent time with your father than the way you spent time with President Doe. But today, today, the man wife over there, you can't even pay attention to her. You, the man that killed the man that your father figure. President Doe was your father figure. President Doe was your father figure. Get that in your mind. You spend more time with President Doe, a president, a powerful military president. Spend more time with you than any other person. Took good care of you. Prince Johnson killed that man disgracefully. Disgracefully. You're not even paying attention to the war crime code. You're not paying attention to it. But you are best friend with Prince Johnson. You see how ungrateful you are, George Weir? The sedition don't know you. They don't know you, George Weir. The people don't know you. That's being ungrateful. George Weir, that's being ungrateful. It hurt my heart because I saw you on black and white TV. With your white and white, you used to love wearing white. Short pants, white t-shirt, with your tight chain and your afro. I used to see you on black and white TV. I'm in my 40s. And I'm, not, and I'm, I'm not a baby. I saw you. That's how ungrateful you are. Because of your power and being self centered, you close friend with Prince Johnson. But the men that make the world to know you today, today. Samuel Kanyan do make the world to know Joia today. He sponsored everything he did, everything to satisfy Joia. How ungrateful can you be when a man that disgracefully killed your 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 how to call it, your, your your father figure, or the man that took care of you even more than your father? Then you say we should what? Have peace, this and that, blah, blah, blah. Does it make sense? You know what the Bible says? You know the Bible talking about your enemy is your enemy. Right? People don't know Judge we are. Popularity because we love football. We love football. What are the hospitals? What are the schools? I just want to know, shall we have? Some of us want to come home. We only need job, that's all. We don't need development. We know how to build. We know how to do everything. We only need jobs. That's all we need. Shall we have? Come on. Come on, man. Come on. 
Liberia is easy to take care of. Liberians are easy to take care of. You give Liberian little money, you give them place to sleep, they get their job, that's it. I would jolly jolly over the weekend. After the weekend, we go to job. We love working for our own money because we love enjoying it. So we are, we want to come home. We don't need development. We need companies. You never took part in the war, right? I just want to know. You never took part in the war, right? Why investors not coming? Because you took part just in the be your, your new father. So we are. You took part just in the be your new father. And people die every day. Why can't you pay attention? Why are you minding these greedy people around you? You know anything start from the head, right? The fish get right in from the head. You won't kill the snake, cut the head off. Prince Johnson is over there. Other people over there. Most generous and other people on the child center. They passing around. What child center? So we are remind yourself. Remind yourself where you coming from. People take you to be the humble and native boy, but you are not. The man spent half of his life in Europe. Seventy-five percent of the man's life is in Europe. Then you can think. And the man saw all the development in Europe. But he said you should buy a CC camera. You are in America here. The government asked you to buy a CC camera for your house. The government asks you. You can't even know they have light in your house. You don't even know. The only thing you got to do is just, just pay the bill. Light that 24 7. Just pay the bill. That's all. Can that happen in small Liberia? My people, you're the sedition. Eh? You can't come to your common sense. Common sense, put Liberia first and put individuals later. Because these individuals are just there to get money, get rich, and go and live in another country. Some are living here, we're living good. But we love our country and we got friends over there. We don't want to see them continuously living like that. We want everyone to be on the same level. That's how the fun and, 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 and death rate and everything can stop. Once everybody on the same level, eating good, getting paid good, get their good job, get their family, no stress. We need justice in our country, Josh we are. You can't even pay attention to that. But you want to sing. You got a church. Print your sing, get a church. The whole damn God business. That's what I tell you, Liberian people. You put yourself beyond God. You're wasting your time. You got to do something physically. <laughs> Just use your common sense. 2,000 years ago. As they say, cut me any plant or tree on earth that reached 1,000 years. I'll wait for the answer. That's just common sense. Everything is lies. My people, everything is lies and question everything. Prince Johnson, your father today now. Chawia. Prince Johnson, your father today. Our, our kid, I saw Prince Johnson cutting somebody's neck just like this. The person fighting, crying. Yeah, wow. Prince Johnson cutting that person's neck. And the tired the person, the leader on the wall, the day on the mud. In Todi, 
Tori Yen Yen Market. I think it was 88 or 89. Prince Johnson captured Tori. That's another story for another day. I saw all the war in Liberia and I partook in all the war in Liberia. Judge, we are put yourself together. Judge, we are. Everything in our country right now, you have power over everything. You can control everything. Use your intellect. Use your common sense. Change the people around you. They're not giving you good advice. Chastida, you can see Chastida today. Chastida horse selling when I went to Congo Town selling them. I mean, I couldn't even see light at his house. And that was the most brightest company you can ever see in Liberia. Shall we put yourself together? JFK is not hard to take care of. You came up with that thing saying the people should have free school, I don't know where, college or what. How will you build a house from the roof? Every house you start building or you build, it starts from the foundation. The foundation. America here, every high school, you know that. You know that, and your children went to these schools. Free! You were celebrated. You didn't pay your children's school fee out of garden. They went to the high schools free. All high schools in America is free. If you go to college now, then you can pay your own money, or how to call it, or take a credit from the government. Why can't you make high school free in the country? People struggling don't have a job. These school fees expensive, Jawia. That's just common sense. Help the people like that. Make a high school free. If you want to go to college, that's your damn business. Everybody don't have to go to college. Everybody don't want to go to college. Some people just want to do their business. Some people just want to learn how to read and write. That's all. And run their business and do other things. And you know, majority of Liberians love business. We love doing things for ourselves. We love running our own thing, waking up on our own time, doing everything. Just we are. The country is very small. The population is very little. Pay attention to the people. The majority. Pay attention to majority. Not the minority that are around you. They're going to let you down tomorrow and run away. According to the Bible story again. If Jesus can be sold by his own people. Who you think you are? Just tell me who you think you are. Just said that they both want to be president. He president now. But he's doing everything wrong. Jawia, Liberia don't need development. We're not in development competition. We're not in development competition with any country. Liberia need a system. A system. Liberia need companies. Liberia need jobs. Liberia need justice. Young people dying every day. Every day. Because your children are living in our country, Jawia. So you're not thinking about that. Right? But don't think you're above everything. The same people that say Hosanna, Hosanna, that the same people that say crucify him, according to your Bible story. Jawia, pay attention to the people. Pay attention to the majority that are crying. People dying. People struggling. Pay attention to them. Not a fake ministers and government officials that are arguing here and there and posting nonsense on Facebook. These, I call it ignorant, disrespectful, 
useless, don't care, educated fools, fake, fake education, education, I mean document, uh, uh, forging, all these clowns, these beings around you. You got to be careful. People just there for the money. You build your character for years as a soccer star, as a legend in Africa. Where is our team? By this time, I thought we were going to have a new stadium. Seriously. Three years in power, soccer star, we don't have a new stadium or a basketball court. Joe, you disgrace yourself. Sometimes I be thinking if you, you did something else for that world best. Seriously. That's me. I question everything. Uh, because I don't know how you want the world best. Or oh, man, I didn't carry a golden shoe in, in two or three leagues and whatsoever, or, or somewhere, uh, uh, or, or a champion league or whatsoever. I don't see all that thing. Eh? But you're lucky to care world best. You hanging on it. At least before people question it, do something for it. Do something that before tomorrow people say, oh, how the man got a war best or this and that? Because people will come to it. But me, I finished questioning it a long time. Put a stadium down. Make sure our team go to African Cup and World Cup in your region. Jawia. If you don't do that, I will tell the same people that I told you that the man is selfish. He's selfish. He's self-centered. He want all the glory for himself. He don't want no other Liberian soccer player to come close to him. I'm telling you, that's just weird. If Joey has seen the video today, Joey won't argue with me. If a, a lieutenant and I ran him to tell him, say, oh, don't do this or this and that. He won't argue with me because he know I'm telling you the truth. Joe, we are selfish. He's self-centered. He wants to be number one in everything. That's not bad to be like that. But you don't run a country like that. If you're not doing the positive things. If you want to be number one in everything, Make sure Liberia justice system is number one in Africa. You see that? That makes sense. Make sure Liberia soccer team, the lone star, should be in every competition in the world. Our football team. Then the people will say, yeah, he's a competitive president. That's competition right there. Make sure our security system should be number one in Africa. In Africa, people say, yes, he's a competitive president. The security system is number one. Our people having good justice. Make sure our livelihoods should be number one in Africa. Good water. Good fresh water. Good solar planet system. That's the only thing I can help Liberia right now. Solar planet system. Because we have a lot of sun. The rainy season we switch we switched our hydro. It's not hard to take care of that country, man. Liberians know how to work, they know how to pay their bills. Just put a system in place. Put a system in place. Make sure current that 24 hour. I was in Liberia with having 24 hour current. You know why? Because I was paying for it. I used to pay like 35, 40 dollars for it. And later on, my brother, my my my, my brother started, started giving me current from his, his booth on the street. He started giving me current to the house. Liberians know how to pay for current. Liberians know how to work. In our community, the people that were working, every one of them had current. 24 hours. Nobody complained. The other people wasn't working, they never had current. 
You see that? That's the difference. We need jobs, not, not development. Liberians eyes are open right now. Most of our, us have traveled. We have seen a bunch of beautiful things we want to carry back home to implement them. But where is the security? Where is the job security? What's the justice system? What's the good hospitals? What's the good schools our children will go to? Tell me, Church we are. Everybody don't have control over all the money right now than you. You know what's going on. You know you can control things, but you just want to be this way. Stop, 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 stop digging hole on your feet. Stop digging hole on your feet. Stop digging holes on your feet. Hmm. I think I say enough for today. Yeah. It hurt me every day. It hurt me. Because I listen to radio every day. Every day had FN. I listen to radio. I know the propaganda. I watch YouTube. I watch all the TV, sh the live TV. I subscribe to them. Things that happen in the community. People carrying camera there, seeing people killing people. Seeing people dead, abandoned in the street. I watch all these things every day. It hurt me. I got children. I got three children here. I want to come back home. I want to go on my fire and chill. I want to get on my boat and on my boat and go on the water and just hang out fishing. You know how easy that life is and beautiful it is. I'm not in competition with anybody. Just want to chill peacefully and work for my own money, not to cheat anybody. No. You work for your own money. You enjoy it. You enjoy it, man. When you sleep at night, you snow. You enjoy it. Shall we are pay attention to the country, not the people that are around you. They're not. They're not helping you. If you pay attention to them, switch them around. They are not helping you. The man that shake your hand. His face doesn't appear to that. Not everyone that shake your hand is your friend. 